Yeah. Hell, Debbie Dark Shines a Light is what this is called. Debbie Dark. East Village, ex-punk, neo-beatnik, performance poet, dancer, yoga teacher, slash, ex-temp, slash, ex-secretary, dash, executive, Sherpa, <laughs> slash, ex-New York City public school teacher, slash, ex-information booth direction giver, part-time, slash, ex, a whole lot of jobs like that, only different, slash, ex, I don't know what the hell I am, slash, 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 I'm a slasher. I am, metaphorically. I slash denial, expose the truth. Some awesome, some awful. The truth, the world is full of it. The truth, everywhere you look, you feel the pull of it. The truth. I live and love New York City. I am a New Yorker. The truth. I am a New Yorker who comes from someplace else. There's a lot of us here. We're called here. It's a karma slash destiny thing. When I came to New York, it was a really, really hard landing. I get here, and bam! My boyfriend and I break up. I need surgery on my knee. My bank account flatlines. My friends start moving up. One gets famous, moved to L.A. Go ahead to phony land, if that's your deal. I'm going where it's real. Washington Square Park. <laughs> Washington Square Park, 1979, by Debbie Dark. <laughs> Through the arch. A junkie shoots up. The fountain is dry. Over there, a transvestite's blowing some guy. Kids stay away, find another place to roam. The guitar man's strung out. This park is his home. Black squirrels getting too close, nerved up from eating needles and gummy bears. A comedian's telling jokes to nobody cares. George Washington's nose is gone. Under him, a coked out freak is working a con. I love this place. <laughs> Look at them all rolling in dirt, broken glass, hooked on drugs, self delusion, fumes of Ginsburg and Dylan's poetic ass. Smoking, tope, token. Doping, falling, drinking, thinking, rats are crawling all over them. <laughs> shit. Oh shit, I gotta get up for work tomorrow. I'll be back to speak more about life and sorrow. Pretty soon after that poem. Let me find where I am. <laughs> Sorry. I got jobs, part-timers turned into full-timers, Debbie dark days became decades of darkness, descending down into the dark, seeking, searching for the truth, waiting for someone who sees me, really me, and hears me. Through years and years, this journey was long, and life is so short, and I know I don't have forever. But all through it, I must say, Washington Square Park, really, really kept me fascinated while I went through. And here we are now in New York City, still my home, Washington Square Park, 21st century. I was walking through Washington Square Park recently on one of those pop-up summer days like today, <laughs> when everyone drops everything and rushes to the park. Washington Square Park, 2017, by Debbie Dark. <laughs> Through the arch, the fountain shoots up high. Over there, the music's blowing through some sexy saxophone guy. People everywhere, warm smiles abound. Kids squealing, keeping it real and running around. George Washington's looking, oh, nose is renewed. 
He's looking like a dude. Under him, people singing, feeling imbued with the breath of life. The breath of life. Look at them all, laying on soft green grass. Every size and shape of curvy, swerving ass. Dreaming, reading, chowing, smiling, kissing, snoozing, looking, beguiling, talking, walking, poking, joking, singing, playing, staying a while, and what the hell happened here? <laughs> Most of it is radiant. People are aglow, you know? I get it. I've changed too. I've changed. I've dropped the old story. I'm staying in the present moment. Life is amazing. It's all that new age bullshit. Therapy, yoga, tai chi, yogi tea, water tank flotation, chanting meditation, positive affirmation, juicing, fasting, sound bathing. <laughs> Digging down to the rock bottom, blasting, getting all the shit up and out. And all those replacement habits. Like, I don't do acid anymore, but I get this monthly organic body cellular skin peel. It's psychedelic. <laughs> and I don't sniff the white powder anymore, but I can order up a spell crust pizza, extra wasabi, mushroom, truffle oil, that'll fly me in the moon sitting in my apartment. <laughs> Yes, I have a new needle habit. Acupuncture. <laughs> Those piercing, penetrating patterns take me to the zone of universal vibrational alignment. What do I do now? Change my name to the artist formerly known as Debbie Dark? No. That is a positive, affirmative no. I'll always be Debbie Dark. It's true. Debbie Dark is here to enlighten you. <laughs> this is something Claire Moed, who just walked in, I think. No, she didn't look like her. <laughs> Claire helped me with this recently. It's Debbie Dark is trying to make a personal ad. So, you know, she's finally coming out of the cave. <laughs> okay, Debbie Dark. Me, I'm, cl I'm a clutchy, deep, passionate, cold, affectionate, devoted poet. I will not have sex on the first date, but I probably will. Only you will not let me get away with that. Coffee is a priority. I'm trying to quit. I have to laugh. Sleep is a major conflict. I love it, yet I want to live without it. Kale is disgusting. All I want is you, all the time. Well, a lot of the time. Friendship means everything. There is always a solution. I need my own room. You, you're quiet, watchful, responsive, smart, and able to smile a lot and often. Your needs are reasonable and fulfillable. You want everything I am. <laughs> so this is another part of me. And it's a poem called Christmas Night. Because it's coming. They wrap their gifts in silence. The pungent smell of hope in the air. Suddenly, the sky fills with a star. Behold. A stable in Bethlehem, the stirring within, bowing to the child. A newborn child has led us to this door. A newborn child lifts us into our hearts. A newborn child will teach us now. In the dark of this night, the light and the sun pours through. Animals are fed. Wise men and women weep for the love of growing. Five minutes? Okay. So f this is called Full Circle, <coughs> December 31st. O luminous moon, 
Here is a year coming round full circle. I stand at the shore at night alone as the offering, ready to be received. O luminous moon, bathe my deepest wounds with your soft, shimmering light. And the sound of waves as I weep, rock me through the night. Carry me from a remembrance of death to a joyful rebirth. Through all of the ancient wisdom here on earth, O luminous moon, having come full circle, feeling your pulls again, knowing inside we are connected, I have returned to my body, my blood, my vessel. O luminous moon, I stand at the shore, at night, alone, ready to embark, knowing I am the ark. The last thing I'm going to do, so I'm going to give more time to other people, which is, yay! Okay. <laughs> Leave them laughing. No, this isn't, I mean, this isn't funny, but, but it's not sad either. So tonight, t today, is my sister Karen's, uh, she would have been 73. So she left the planet two years, two weeks, and 16 days ago. And it was a shock, but, and you know, it, it's one of those things where uh, she left so much love and bright light on this planet that it can never be a downer. You know, she's just, she's here with me and with us. And so I want to, to, this is in honor of her, and she always supported my poems and was like, stop, get them published, you know, and I was like, ah. <laughs> So this is to uh, the name of it is to us. It's to it's to you as well as to Karen, and it's to all of us right now. To us, thank you for your grace and dignity, for your generous heart, and clear insight, for reminding us all it is what it is, and everything's gonna be all right if we keep believing, if we keep laughing. We have to laugh. If we remember, kindness can heal every heart. If we go through it together, never apart. And if we recognize the special times, like every chance to dance, like taking a beach walk or having a heartfelt talk. If we share what's going on enough to know we're all going through difficult stuff. How glad our hearts are for knowing you. And whether we understand or not why God called you home, we are ever grateful and happy that God made you known to us. Amen.